there's a lot of opportunities with the uh, co-products being uh, DDGs, ethanol or uh, malt. In the case of uh, DDGs, uh, even though it's very well used, especially in central and northern Mexico, there is a, a potential market uh, in southeast Mexico where we currently are running uh, programs to uh, teach uh, end users over there how to use them. Uh, malt, uh, we have our own craft brewing, uh, brewer uh, industry that is uh, growing. It just started, but it's growing at the same uh, rate as the U.S. Has, has been. So that's a very exciting market because it's new. And uh, in the case of ethanol, uh, that is uh, one of the biggest uh, gambles. Uh, it involves energy. Uh, it, it, it involves uh, fuels. So uh, currently, uh, that is a new market because Mexico has privatized their uh, oil industry. And now uh, there's a lot of uh, opportunities because uh, uh, gasoline is going to be imported for the first time and distributed by third parties or uh, independent companies instead of uh, uh, the monopoly that we used to have called Pemex. Mm -hmm.